Hello my friends, this is Eric Parker with One Number Tableau Experts. In this week's quick tip video, we're gonna dive into how to utilize the reset view button that you may find on Tableau Server, Tableau Cloud, and Tableau Public. Uh, let me dive into an example here. Uh, this is a dashboard called the Multilingual Student Overview that we made uh, with a great client of ours, Auburn School District. So shout out to you all. Thanks for letting us uh, de-identify the data and uh, utilize it for examples like this. Um, so in this example, I've, I've made a number of selections in my filters, things like school and grade. There's actually even a parameter where I've made a selection. And so you may be doing some analysis in Tableau and then you might say, okay, I wanna clear all these filters. It's kind of a nuisance to have to click through one, two, three, four, five, six filters at a time to clear them all out to start your analysis all over again. So yeah, you can clear the page and come back to it, but you don't have to do that, right? There's actually this button up here in the top left corner, it's called Reset View. That will do probably exactly what you're looking for, right? So I should also say that, you know, if you make a selection, like I click on this bar in this worksheet, right? Whether it's a filter selection, parameter selection, a worksheet selection, um, all of that stuff, you know, should be cleared out when you reset the view, okay? It's gonna go ahead and just set it back to what it looked like by default. So a lot of people want to go to kind of these extra lengths to create a reset view button where it like clears all your filters out and you can still do that. And, and maybe you want to have like a big fancy looking reset button right there that people can click on. In fact, we have a video on that and I'll link that in the description. So if you really, like really determined, like I need a reset button, you can do that, but you also may not need to. Maybe it's just a matter of coaching your users up and showing them, hey, there's a reset view button there. So maybe it even includes forwarding this video to them and saying, hey, why don't you just follow what Eric is doing here? Okay, this is actually also available on Tableau Public. So if you're sharing your work there, right, same exact vibe. I've selected a school, a grade, a household income level, a student population. Um, and now I wanna set this back to how it was. This one, I don't, why did they put these things in different places? I don't know. Uh, this one is a little more hidden. I gotta kinda go down to the bottom right here. And then there's the same reset view button. Whoops, uh, same reset view button right here. And if I select that, Looks like it's loading and it just cleared out all my filters and selections here on Tableau Public as well. So I hope this reset view button is helpful to you and to your users. Uh, we drop videos like this every week, so feel free to follow along. If you ever need our help, just shout uh, in the description in the comments below. You can check out our office hours where you can just book us one-on-one -on -one for personalized help. We do Tableau classes every month. We'd love to have you there to get to dive even deeper on topics like this with you. So thanks so much and uh, we'll catch you next week. Thanks.